The Quraysh worship stones and trees. Alat, Manat, and Alusa. Listen, Alat was a stone, a white stone. Look it up. Alat was a white stone. Alusa was a tree. Listen to me. Manat was another great uh, stone idol where they used to call Hajj from. This is when the pagans used to circumambulate round the Kaaba seven times because they worshipped their seven heavenly bodies. Mercury, Satan, um, Saturn, sorry, right? Mars, Earth, Sun, those seven planets. It's actually Satan, I was right in the first place. Hallelujah! And so when Muhammad got attacked in the cave, he was beside himself because he wanted to please his people. He didn't want to leave the pagan religion behind. He didn't want to. He loved stones. He loved trees. But when he came to his people and he said, I'm a prophet, the Quraysh said, run away from it, why? We worship stones and trees. And Muhammad said, it's okay. You can keep going round them. Keep going round the Kaaba and kissing that stone. Because Muhammad himself said, trees spoke to him. Stones saluted him. Muhammad said this, he had an affinity. He had a love for his pagan religion and he didn't want to leave it behind. That's why he said, the black stone forgives sins. And Muslims got suckered into believing that an inanimate object forgives sins. Did anybody know what animism is? Where did I do my research? I've just read the hadith. Animism. Let me explain. I've just read the hadith, sir. Where did you do your research? Who did you do it with? Okay, I went to Saudi Arabia. Now listen. Animism. Does anybody know what animism is? Somebody explain to me if you know what animism. A N I. M-I-S-M. What is animism? See here, he wants to change the subject. Rather than addressing, if he wants to address the stone issue, I'm willing to talk to this guy, but he won't. So let me finish. What about the cross? What about the cross? Hold on. Animism, animism is the... Don't put your hand on me. Animism is the belief that inanimate objects have souls. Why do you keep... Animism is the belief that inanimate objects have souls. That is why Muhammad believed that trees prostrated to him. This is why Muhammad believed that stones saluted him. He believed. I'll read you a hadith. I'll read you a hadith where Muhammad said that a tree informed him of something. I'll read your hadith where Muhammad said, right? Muhammad said, listen, listen. He called me a liar. I can pull out every bit of proof from the hadith that I'm talking about. Muhammad said that the stone that he used to know when he was a pagan, right? Saluted him before he was a prophet. He told his people about it after he was a prophet. He carried it into the religion. Right. He loved stones and trees, right. and he put the black stone there so that every Muslim will worship Satan yes. by following a pagan religion. Yes. Circumambulating around the Kaaba. Why did you? Why did Muhammad? If he was such a, if he was such a prophet of God, listen. If he wanted to just, let me see what. No, but I'm just saying. Let me see what. Hold on. If Muhammad, listen. You know what, Joshua? Has anybody heard of Joshua? Joshua, when he went to Canaan and he wanted to destroy all the pagan religion, their temples, their stones, their altars, God said, smash them, purge the land of all the pagan religion, their stones, their altars. Why did Muhammad destroy the Kaaba? Why did he not destroy the stone? God said, grind the stone into powder. Why? Because he's a pagan and he's given you a pagan religion. He wanted to hold on to the pagan religion. 
Muslims. Yes. Why do you keep the cross? 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 Have you done Hajj? Have you done Hajj? I'm asking you. I listen to you. No, you're, I've asked your question. You haven't answered it. Yeah. But you want to answer me. Yeah. No. What do you mean? I'd like one Muslim to ask, yes, answer my question. Why do you kiss the stone? We don't kiss the stone. It's, 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 it's really sad. You know, God loves you, Muslims. He wants you to stop circumambulating the Kaaba naked. That's what they used to do. Your hadith said that it was a, it was a fertility rite. They used to circumambulate seven times and they were all naked. The only difference is yeah. that you got this little thing on, but everyone's naked underneath. That's right. Everyone knows what happens when yeah, the men so are pushing up against so the women. All naked? We're, we're when there's thousands of you going around like that. How sad! How sad! Everybody is desperate to touch this, to touch this inanimate object, and if they can't touch it, they stretch out just to be in the direction of it. How sad! That's wrong. God wants That's to come wrong. and live with you. That's not in Islam. He wants to know you. Are we all naked now? Yeah, he's speaking to you. Are we all naked now? He loves you. Stop this nonsense. Well, no, you believe in the of the Kaaba. You believe on the same as the Kaaba. The stone was put there by Ibrahim, not Muhammad. Get your facts straight. Yeah. Did I say Muhammad? Yes, did. did I say Muhammad yes, put the stone there? Yes, he did. Yes, did. I did not say Muhammad put the stone there. I said Muhammad kept the stone there because it was already there because they were practicing a pagan religion. That's right. That's right. That's right. So, but we're telling you this, we don't, we, we don't believe that as God. People just it is mandatory because they're human beings. They kiss it. They human beings. Yeah, Why? Our prophet didn't tell us to kiss it. Yes, he did. Our prophet. No, he didn't. I just read the hadith. No, he didn't. He Twice I've read the hadith. Where did you get your hadith? Where did you get it from? Sunan.com. What? What's what? That? All of a sudden, they don't know what Sunan.com is. No, the from most from prolific Muslim website of hadith. There's no idea what it is. Quran. Why? Why? Why Quran, sir? Why? Why do you not? Why Quran? Are you throwing out the hadith? Can I ask you a question? Why do Christians kiss the cross and do this? Rather than addressing why? their pagan rights, I am willing I to discuss anything. I don't kiss the cross. No, people in our religion that kiss I don't kiss the cross. The stones, they're wrong. I don't worship. I don't worship dead people. I don't pray to dead people. Muhammad is dead. You pray to him, Muslim. Why? This is this is this is what happens. This is what happens every week. Muslims, God bless you. You have no answers. You have no answers. You just follow blindly. And it grieves me. You follow blindly. No one knows what's written in the Quran. Who here speaks Arabic? See, they're laughing. Can you speak Arabic, sir? No. Can you speak Arabic? No. Can you speak Arabic? No. That's three out of three can't speak Arabic. So they don't even know what's written in their own book. So no wonder they've got no answers for me. And you know, sir, you know what? I'm, I'm speaking to those Muslims who are, I'm speaking to the Muslims. Guys, listen, listen. I'm speaking to the Muslims who are asking questions to themselves. Jesus, Jesus never lied. Jesus never lied. But they're too afraid to tell their brothers. They're too afraid. Oh, here we go. Do you speak Greek? Right, okay. Do you speak Aramaic? Are you willing to discuss? Do you speak Greek? Are you, are you smash and run. Smash and run. Smash and run. Look, is it smash and run? If you can't answer, then don't Then what? Then what? Can you speak Arabic, sir? Can you speak Arabic? Can you speak Hebrew? Can you speak Greek? I understand what's written in the Bible. So, so do we. But how? How? Translate it. Translate it. How do you understand it? Let me tell you, brother. How do you understand it? Okay, let me tell you. Are you willing to discuss something? Are you willing to discuss this? Okay. Now you have a translation. You have translation. Let me give you an example, right? Because what happens is that your muftis and imams, they lie to you 
I'll not prove to you why. No, no, we don't. Like, let no, me no, prove no, to you. Tell me how do you, 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 you discuss bro. in translation. You, 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 you don't want to discuss translation. Do you know you're not, Jay? Hold on, hold on. Do you know you're not, Jay? He don't want to discuss translation. Do you know We know our translations are correct. Do you know you're not, Jay? No, I'm not making it. No, I'm not making it. I'm not making it. I'm not making it. Are we all naked now? He asked us why. Are we all naked now? Stop jumping around. Because we're naked underneath. Stop jumping around. There you go. You can't ask him. Stop jumping around. We're talking about you. If you if you speak Greek, but you're telling me about what was he telling me? No, no, he he talked about Greek. Okay, have you finished? Wait, a waste of time. You're gonna argue me. A waste of time. Brother, you're a sensible brother. I can tell. You're not Muslim. Okay, that's fine. All the Muslims, listen. All the Muslims that are secretly wondering. Why am I following this thing? But they can't tell their brothers or sisters because Muhammad said that the penalty for apostasy is death. They are, they are afraid to even bring it up. And those Muslims who go to the Imams and ask the questions, the Imams who lie to them. What's the, what's the penalty for treason? What's the penalty for treason? If, what's the penalty for treason? penalty for leaving God? In Christianity, what the penalty yeah. we right. if, Listen, brothers, listen. And we ain't got no problem with that. We so you're left with these questions. questions. We ain't got no problem with the your Quran or the Sharia, mate. Right? Maybe to you, no, no, who but not ask. to us. You no, can't no. ask Allah, because he don't speak to you. Yeah. You can't ask the Imam, because they lie to you. Yeah. But you do want to know, why am I kissing a stone? You really do want to know, why am I kissing a stone? The sensible people on this earth will wonder. They won't just follow. When I came to the Lord Jesus Christ, I asked a million questions. I wanted proof. I wanted evidence. But you just admitted that you prayed to a dead man. You must You are confused, guys. We don't question our faith. We don't need to. We have 100% faith in our religion. That's why you question our faith, but that's why we don't. Okay, brother. Okay, brother. Brother, one second. That's a straight on. I've got We don't worship Muhammad. Forget about us. We do not worship Muhammad. We still abandon. You want to follow? You want to follow without asking questions? You want to follow without asking questions, right? That's what you're saying. Because your faith is strong enough, right? Is that what you said? That's what we do. Let me just confirm. You see, he's trying to drag you away because you're asking questions. He's asking questions and immediately you're trying to drag him away. Brother, listen to me. Use your own brain. Use your own brain. If he's not a soul, your soul, not his. Your soul. Not him. Now, you made a statement. No, hold on, hold on. You made a statement. Can I address your statement? Right. You said, you said that you don't need to ask questions because your faith is strong enough. Right? That's what you said. I said I never had to. You never had to. If I wanted to, Allah says we are allowed. Allah says we are allowed. We are allowed. Hold on. Did everybody hear that? He said that if he wanted to ask questions, Allah said. He's allowed. Wrong! <laughs> let me prove to you why. Let, brother, let me prove to you why. Let me prove to you why. In Quran, in, the, in Surah, are you listening to me? Let me ask you a question. Brother, brother, in Surah, let me put it to you this way. Don't you think if, if something bothered you, if something bothered you in your religion, and it was really troubling you, that you should be able to ask your Imam, don't you think so? Yeah, thank you. So why does your Quran say don't? Let me read to you. Let me read to you. Don't get your hadith so get them proper sources, bro. Hold on, brother. Hold on, hold on. Go to Islamic Quran. 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 Go it's even got a transliteration. He's saying it's no good. It's not reliable. It's not reliable. You don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. Show me that somewhere else. Should I give him a reliable source? No. Brother, that's really sad. You told me before. Fill out.com. That's not a reliable source. This is also not a reliable source. Give me some evidence, but it's not reliable. Don't say that. Don't say that. Don't say that. No, no. He's done. No, you're from Dayton. Yes, sir.
Brother, listen to me. Muhammad has tied your hands. He's tied your hands. He's tied your hands. He doesn't want you to ask questions. He doesn't want you to ask questions. Can you read Islam? Can you read Islam now? Okay, look, let's end the sentence. I'm allowed to question my opinion. It's an untruthful discussion. It's an untruthful Yeah, family. It's a shame that no Muslim can defend their prophet. No Muslim can tell me why they kissed the black stone. No Muslim can tell me why they circumambulate the cargo. No Muslim has any answer. Jesus is the answer. He's the way, the truth, and the life. The bread of life, the resurrection, and the life. And they need to stop following these pagan religions and kissing the stone to forgive their sins and bow the knee to Jesus Christ and accept him as Lord and Savior.